What's new? Football Sunday. And what's your time, brother? Just started. That's three penalties on San Diego in about five minutes. We've got three penalties and already burned a timeout. What a great start. Wait, Dad, how does Rivers throw the ball? What the hell is this? <laughs> Dad, what are you doing today? Painting our room. My dad literally can't get enough of painting. He painted my room first, Brian's room, Brian's room and now our room. this room. Every Sunday for the last three weeks, paint. Bosley, stop eating the boxers. Oh, this one's heavy. Does that feel good, Bosley? Process. Bosley, are you not gonna help? You live in this house, you eat food, you drink water, you don't pay bills, you don't help out when my dad is cleaning the room. You're a waste of space, Bosley. Well, time to go to the gym. Time to go to the gym. The Chargers played like fucking trash today, and I'm not gonna sit and waste my time watching that, those last 10 minutes. I mean, we're down 31-7 with about two million penalties in one game. That cost us like 900 yards. And our offensive line, I'm just gonna put it this way. For all you Charger fans who say Rivers is shit, have you seen our offensive line? We give him I'd say 0.2 seconds for every single throw. He's getting pressured and rushed every single play, but I'm over that. The Chargers lose one and two. Also, I want you guys' opinions on, um, cause you guys know, I say this a bunch of times, almost every video. I don't play video games, but I was thinking about buying 2K, which would also require me to buy an Xbox One cause I don't have a video game system. Um, if you guys are into that and would watch videos that I would make, playing NBA 2K, then I'll do it. But if not, leave it in the comments so I don't waste my money. But yeah, if you guys are interested and you guys would watch me playing NBA 2K, I'm not sure, quick games, career mode, I don't even know what it is. But I mean, tell me, I'll go buy an Xbox One, go buy 2K and put up some videos for you guys. Let's see the progress so far, Dad, on camera. Wow. So, one wall already done, red. Dad, are you gonna start doing bookings for paintings? A lot of my fans say that they want you to paint their room. I love it, but it's too much work. I know. 
real cool, sweaty, hard work. Real quick thoughts on the Chargers game. Stupid team. <laughs> Idiot coach. <laughs> what about the quarterback? The quarterback, you need to learn throw the ball like this. We're not going anywhere, I think. So it's official, according to my dad. Week three is done, and the Chargers are done for the season. <laughs> dad, it's okay. NBA training camp starts tomorrow. Preseason next week, regular season in four weeks. Well, sucks for my dad because the Lakers aren't going anywhere either, so he has to deal with the Chargers and the Lakers. I do feel bad for my dad, though, because we're both Charger fans, so we got to deal with the struggling start, one and two, and the team just looking shitty. But I got something to look forward to. When NBA starts, I got the Phoenix Suns to look forward to. Eric Bledsoe, Brandon Knight, Tyson Chandler, P.J. Tucker, T.J. Warren, Devin Booker. I mean, he's a Laker fan, so... What does he have to look forward to? Feel bad for him. I saved you a slice on that. Okay, thank you. Randy, you motherfucker! Shout. Straight to the shower for rug. Congrats on 900k. Thank you guys all. Right now, I'm on my way to meet up with Brian and my cousin Amanda. We are about to go to my other cousin Clint's house. Yes, I have more family that you guys haven't met. Um, he's my older cousin. He's like 26, 27, and he just bought his first place. So we're going to go check it out. And uh, I'm going to bring you guys along for the trip. I have... That guy just saw me talking. He probably thinks I'm crazy, but uh, I swear I have like... I have a bunch of cousins. It's crazy. I have, I'd say like 8 million that live in this city. Rug, Amanda, why am I sitting in the back seat? <laughs> We're looking for Clint's house right now. I would live here. You live in the bathroom. Clint, say hi. Oh, what up, Brandon? This is my cousin Clint. He loves me, I love him. He used to be my gym buddy before he moved away. And your babysitter. And my babysitter when I was younger. So I guess Clint's dump smells so bad that he needs an incense thing. Yeah. I feel the same exact way. What is this, Clint? Cards against humanity. <laughs> Five rounds in a row, I won. will happen. Today we're making rice, white rice, with a little bit of yellow rice and <laughs> oh, hey, what's up? Welcome. Wait, what did, what did you just say would happen if you had another controller? <laughs> oh, I would destroy his rug. He, uh, okay, let's get to the truth of the story. He would beat me at the game, and I would get up, and I'd be like, stupid, and then I'd like, beat him up. Bye, Clint. Clint, we love you. It was fun. We, uh, nice house. Yeah. Bye, Peace. guys. It was fun. Peace. Okay, back home. Is that bother? Let's see how far my dad has gotten. Dad, you're done? Yeah. Okay, so I didn't know my dad was gonna be done. Let me do <laughs> Dad, it looks nice. You like it? Yes. It's not better than my son's one, but it's nice. Oh, this is sexy. What's up, you guys? Monday morning. Um, I'm freaking happy because Phoenix Suns Media Day is going on. And if you guys are unaware of the situation, Markeith Morris spent all summer bashing the Suns organization, talking trash on them, saying he won't ever play another game for the Suns again, you know, just demanding trades here and there. Um, he also ignored all the all the phone calls from Phoenix Suns players, Phoenix Suns front office members. He pretty much like just trashed the organization all summer. Media Day, which was today, is his first time interacting with the team ever since last season. So um, everyone was wondering how this was going to end up. Markeith Morris shows up and he says, I want to be here. He says he wants to put everything behind him. He wants to put everything in the past. He doesn't even want to talk about the summer. He said, I'm glad to be back with my teammates. I'm glad to be back with my team. 
I'm freaking so happy because although Marquise Morris talked so much trash on the Suns and begged to leave the team, and I'll admit there were times where I hated him, like which Suns fan wouldn't hate him? But at the same time, as you could see, I even wrote an article last month why the Suns need to keep Marquise Morris. He's such an important piece to the team. And now, I mean, like, he was the only question mark. We have point guards. We have shooting guard. Center, Tyson Chandler said. All we needed was this power forward position kind of answered. And the fact that Marquise Morris wants to stay, man, I'm so happy. Like, who knew Marquise Morris had a little bit of professionalism in him? He came out. Man, I'm so happy. I knew it. I knew he just because he has a bunch of best friends on the team. Eric Bledsoe, PJ Tucker, uh, those are close friends to him. So Archie Goodwin. So he got with them, and I guess they like. I saw him smiling, which you would have never thought based on the things he said. So Marquise Morris, welcome back. The Phoenix Suns are officially on track for next season, and this kid right here cannot wait.